Ivan Penkov, Kazanluk, 1897, Sofia, 1957. I dreamed of being a Bulgarian artist since I was a child, said Ivan Penkov, whose artistic nature was steeped in the theatre. Istvan, as he was called by his students, was born on the 30th of April, 1897. His hometown of Kazanluk and his family first brought him up to love art and the theatre. His mother, Maria Kostadinova Vladeva, was a teacher and one of the first female actresses in the town. His father, Georgi Ivanov Penkov, was a publisher and amateur photographer. Kazanluk was host to one of the oldest community centres and amateur dramatics in which Ivan Penkov took part since his childhood together with Ivan Milev, another great Bulgarian artist. Orphaned at a very early age, his path towards the arts passed through the Southern Front in the First World War. In 1919, he was accepted at the State School of Industrial Art in Sofia, where he studied painting under Petko Klisurov and the decorative arts under Professor Stefan Bajov. From 1922 to 1923, he continued his education in Munich under Professor Meyershofer and Professor Hengeler. He visited Berlin, Nuremberg, Augsburg, Regensburg and other places. The environment he found there, from the official art in the exhibition halls through German Expressionism to Futurism, Dadaism and the Russian Constructivists, left a lasting trace on his personality as an artist and turned him into a modern interpreter of the Bulgarian heritage and an eminent representative of the homeland art movement. Returning to Bulgaria, he devoted himself to his greatest passion, the theatre. On the 1st of September 1924, he joined the National Theatre Art Studio as assistant manager. Here, together with Ivan Milev, he set out to find new ways to design stage sets, making a debut with the play He Who Gets Slapped by Leonid Andreev, staged by Yosif Osipov. In 1933, Ivan Penkov graduated from the Decorative Art Department at the Academy of Art with a newly appointed lecturer, his childhood friend Dechko Uzunov. Right after his graduation, he joined the Society of New Artists. He was appointed as lecturer on the Decorative Arts through an appointments procedure at the Academy of Art where he initiated a theatrical painting class. Penkov carefully selected the dramaturgy for his plays, which had reached 40 in number by the end of his life on 28th November 1957, in cooperation with the greatest Bulgarian directors from the beginning of the 1920s. His stage set projects include As You Like It by William Shakespeare, 1935 to 1936, When Lightning Strikes by Peyo Yavorov, 1940, and Romeo and Juliet by William Shakespeare, in cooperation with Maria Trendafilova and Venera Naslednikova. Together with his picturesque and innovative theatrical projects, Ivan Penkov worked on mosaics, stained glass, posters and spatial exhibition design in Bulgaria and abroad. An interesting feature in his biography are his collages named In the Spirit of Matisse, created spontaneously in his Bohemian albums. This artist's creative creed was that art should draw its inspiration from the depths of national style, independently of the time of its creation and the forms it takes. Ivan Penkov's work is an example of inexhaustible creative activity and energy. Throughout his life, the theatre provoked his artistic imagination, creating a modern world inhabited by new and dreamlike characters.